Welcome back to Ben Reviews. I'm Ben T. Looney, and where are all the new episodes of Wander Over Yonder? Recently, Cartoon Network has created a new show. Now, you know that when it comes to the Cartoon Network's recent shows, they don't really agree with me that much. Except for Gumball, of course. Oh, and of course, that's totally my fault. Yeah, how dare I have my own taste in media? That's what I get for thinking that I have free speech in this democratic country of ours. So, let's take a look at Clarence to see how Cartoon Network can handle not having a surreal fantasy show. So, this show is about a socially awkward kid named Clarence, who's a kid living in the suburbs with his friends, and... That's pretty much it. Really? No fantasy world with uninteresting main characters? No formulaic plot lines that have underwhelming payoffs? And no barrage of constant nightmare-inducing surreal imagery? Wow, I was wrong about Cartoon Network. They're not just banking off of the success of Adventure Time and Regular Show. They're trying out new genres of animation that they can play around with. Good for them. That's more than I can say about... other channels. So, what do I think of the show itself? To be honest, it's actually pretty decent. The characters are innocent and good-natured, the plot lines are simple but fun, the animation style actually matches the feel of childhood, and the humor is relatable and situational. Sure, it's not a show that I would go out of my way to watch. As you know, I'm very picky when it comes to my cartoons, but it seems harmless enough to entertain anybody who thinks that the Amazing World Gumball is too weird for them. I'm glad I checked it out, as I feel that that time that I dedicated to it wasn't wasted. See, people? I'm willing to admit when I think modern Cartoon Network shows have effort put into them. Hey, wait a minute. How many times have I told you that I love Gumball? Why don't any of you acknowledge that? You know, I'm starting to get the idea that some of you just love to have excuses to hate me, so you ignore certain aspects that wouldn't have you think otherwise. But that's silly. I'm able to see the good in everybody, and I know that no breathing human being is that hateful. But if they are, I'll still love you. Forever. Forever. Sorry to sound creepy, but I feel that tone will help you remember that. Anyway, I've been T. Looney. I'm gonna go put my shields up. Just in case. Into the grave.